Hi folks, this is Kalle from Plan 8 uh, and I'm here to show you a little demo of our Chrome experiment, uh, Band Controller. Um, let's start by enter the bandcontroller.se address and uh, it's loading sounds and then it tells me to connect my game controller which is my iPhone device. So I uh, I point it to bandcontroller.sc and enter the code I'm giving on given on the screen. So now we're at the first level and uh, we can hear the hi-hat beat uh, starting. Um, and the aim of the first level is to get a proper mix of the track uh, we're going to listen to. So tap to continue. So we can see the audience uh, cheering and you can see the audience satisfaction meter going down because I'm not doing anything. So I'm going to take these faders on my phone and um, bring up the drums a little bit. Uh, you can see the meter of uh, the drums moving to the beat and uh, a good level is close to high as you can get without getting it distorted. If you go higher and it's red and it sounds distorted, so take it down a little bit. You can see the audience is not very happy with what I'm doing right now because I'm too slow. So I'm going to try to bring up all the meters to decent levels. Good, so this level is done and it takes us to the next level and um, this level is about setting a good uh, reverb mix on the vocal track and we use uh, the pinch gesture uh, on the iPhone to change the, the room size and it's a convulsion reverb uh, from the Web Audio API. Uh, so let's check it out. Yeah, so this cube represents uh, how big the room is. Right now it's uh, too big. Um, you can see we can, I can change uh, it to, to completely dry. Something like that. And I can make it really big. Oops. Like that. And uh, the decent level in this case would be where the cube is a perfect cube. So um, this takes us to the next and final level of this little uh, demo and experiment, um, where it tells me to tilt my iPhone to the landscape mode. And I'm about to play a synthesizer with uh, two oscillators um, generating the the tone uh, and um, we also have a, a filter connected to it where you can uh, alter the and control the filter frequency cutoff by tilting your phone forward and backwards and the tone frequency is right to left so lower uh, sorry lower and higher notes so let's take it for a ride so the aim is to get all the dots or lines and we will change, um, you can see that I changed the cutoff by tilting it forward and backwards, moving it up and down, very nicely so well. So as I take these different colored dots, it changes. Uh, waveforms for me. So right now I'm on a sine wave. This I think is a triangle. Okay, that's it for now. Uh, please um, remember bandcontroller.se and pay the visit. Thank you and bye.